Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to create a domain controller using Windows Server Core. But first, um, we, we will try to ping the server 01. And we're going to use the configuration host only adapter. And we're going to try to ping the server 01 to see if we have communication. We will have some sort of communication, but um, later on the exercise, I'm going to explain you why we have to use uh, the right configuration on VirtualBox in order to contact the server. So this is the server core and it's server 02. So now I'm calling the server 01 and I have a communication, right? It's unreachable, but I have a connection. The package will send and will uh, return. Now I'm going to use the internal network on server 01 and I'm going to try to ping uh, the server 02 that is a server core so now that the ping was sent I have uh, the destination host unreachable uh, but the packages are sent and received zero loss so zero percent loss and hundred percent send and return so let's exit and let's go to the server core now we're gonna type the DC promo that X question mark forward slash question mark to get all the switches for this command, some of the switches for this command and in this case you're gonna use the promotion that easy promo that x forward slash question mark column promotion to add the active directory domain services since you know that we don't have the um, the graphical interface on server core we need to use the the server uh, the, uh, the CMD command prompt so now let's type the switch this is promo.dex promotion press any key um, I was trying to install the gates additions in the server core but it wasn't unable because I just I just tried to pass the, the commands to make it faster but I was unable to do that so now we need to type this command. I, I'm gonna let this command on the description because it's a uh, it's really complex. It's, it's long, and we need to pay attention on the capitalization and the switches and the spaces too. So I will have some errors that I fix later, but um, you need to pay attention on as as you are typing. Uh, and the password is the one that you use on exercise 1 when you install the server core that is the administrator password for the server core so now I'm trying to reach the server 01 but 
I got the ensure that the, that you supply the correct DNS server, the DNS domain name. So that means that I couldn't contact the server 01. So I'm gonna switch to my server 01, and I'm gonna change the configuration on the the um, devices network. I'm gonna switch to host only adapter that is the one that works for now on these exercises so we can contact both servers and client computers too so now retype the um, the pass uh, the command and here uh, you need to enter the administrator password but what I suggest is you create an account with administrative privileges so uh, in this case if something wrong goes on the server it wasn't the administrator account that is the most powerful um, a, um, account in, in the domain so you can use a um, regular account with administrative privileges to install these types of softwares or test environment. Now the installation is being is being processed. These things this take quiet some time. So let's just wait. Okay, after the Active Directory domain services is installed, the computer is going to reboot automatically. So that means that the server core, uh, the, the, uh, the role was installed properly. Now enter your administrator password. And voila, that's it for, that's it for this practice. Thank you for watching and please comment and suggest.